Hello everyone. Welcome to my new property. First thing you're gonna notice is there's a lot of stuff here. And that is because the previous owners who own this place actually owned an antique shop, a couple of antique shops, I think, and they left a lot of stuff here. A lot of stuff to go through and a lot of stuff to sell or fix or basically, I don't know, whatever I do with it. Now I was just flying my drone and I accidentally stepped into a red ant pile. So that's the reason why I have no shoes on right now. I'm gonna go find them real quick because I kind of threw them off my feet. And then I'm gonna give you guys a quick tour around my new property. <sighs> we brought some stuff here today, but there's still a lot more stuff to bring. Don't wanna to bring too much things here until we start to clear things out. As you can see, there's a lot. That's the resident. He's staying, he's a squatter. It's a cool table. Yeah, that's a cool table, yeah. This is really cool too. Bubble rocking chair. Oh, what is it? What is it? Big old wasp. Oh. My mom is actually here cleaning up on the inside. She came here to clean up the inside. This is dark. Let me turn on the lights, but I don't think it's gonna help much. So that's a really cool front farmhouse. Go oh, ring the bell. No. Alright, cool. It means the food's ready. Dinner's ready. So I asked if they can keep these lights and the skull head, and they did, and a lot more. Here are them plugged in, and it's gonna look really good at night. A barbecue, and then under here, some friends, like maybe a bonfire going right there. Even though we're not going through everything, check this out. An old 1960s maybe, Sears Town motorcycle, so. That's gonna be really cool to see if that runs or just to see what we can do with it. Probably gonna be a showpiece. Here is a fire pit that I will be rebuilding. And then here is, we'll go to the barn. Apart a little bit, but it's really cool space. I think the GoPro will get the low lighting better in that camera, but uh, Pretty big in here, a lot of cool stuff. There's also a second story. So, right now you can't access it, but if you can see in there. As long as I don't fall. <laughs> All right, and now we're going to the aircraft hangar. <sighs> so we didn't really get to explore here too much because there happened to be a lot of very big wasp nests in here and we have to clear them out. Yeah, this space is huge, as you can see. We got some cool like lockers from a prison or something nearby and a bunch of other stuff, so. Once it starts rolling, it's easy to roll. Ready? Into the aircraft hangar. It'd be better if I push it. You... Uh, there we go. Out of the elements. And inside of here, we have a workshop. A lizard was just crawling up this thing. Inside of here, we have a workshop. Okay, so the lights, I don't think the lights work down below. And there's a second floor, second story. They left a really tall ladder here. A really tall ladder. Why is it about to fall off? Huh, look at that. Am I getting higher? Pretty clean up here. And uh, the roof over there is super dirty, super dirty. But uh, what do I expect? I have a lot of cleaning to do. Good to see. 
Roof on the barn is a little bit dirty too though. Yeah, you must have had this holy system on here to bring like buckets or something up. That's kind of cool. Now we're working on getting some yard equipment because we got nothing. Because we have a lot of yard all the way over there. A lot of big cypress trees on this property. Like I have this little forest area. Nature preserve. I have a, I have my own I have my own nature preserve. So that's pretty cool. And apparently this thing right here is really expensive and really cool and it's hanging on by a chain. And uh what's it called? The staghorn I think. It's kinda I don't know if it's making the tree do this or not, but it could be. It actually would have been a lot easier not using that, but I just really wanted to use it. 